Hi everyone, my name is Amanda and I'm a fourth year medical student. And my name is Tejas and I'm a second year medical student and we are the leaders of the Plastic and Reconstructive Surgery Interest Group. We are here today to teach you about proper wound care. Wound healing is an incredibly important part of plastic surgery and that's what our activity today is going to be on. Today's activity is a variation of the classic slime recipe. Here's what you're going to need. A bear, liquid glue, borax, water, food coloring, optional glitter, mixing bowls and mixing utensils, measuring cups, gloves, scissors, a pair of socks, and paper towel. Let's go ahead and get started. The first thing we want to do is make our red slime. Pour out a quarter cup of liquid glue into a measuring cup. You will notice it is very liquidy and runny. Next, you will want to add a quarter cup of water to the glue. Mix the water and the glue really well together. Once your water and glue mixture is well combined, set aside. In a separate container, you will want to mix a half cup of warm water with a quarter teaspoon of borax. Once your borax is added to your water, make sure to mix vigorously until the borax is completely dissolved and your solution is clear. Next, Add a couple drops of your desired food coloring to the borax water solution. Once mixed, add your borax water solution to the glue mixture and begin stirring vigorously that the red slime is a lot thicker than the original glue that we started out with. And why is that, Amanda? When you add the borax to the glue, it acts like a material in your body to help stop bleeding. Wow, that's so cool. That's how blood clots are formed and stabilize cuts. Exactly. The blood is initially liquid, but over time, a solid scab forms and turns hard so we can heal. Now that we have our slime mixed, Let's go ahead and place it on the underside of this cut bear's arm. Next, we are going to cut apart our sock. This is going to be our wound closure system and help the edges of the skin close together. And finally, we are going to use our last slime mixture to uh, serve as our dermabond, which is a special type of skin glue to really help our bear heal. Wow, that looks great! Thanks for helping Mr. Bear on his road to recovery. We hope you give this activity a try. Uh, take care and have fun.